Tulsa police and Tulsa Crime Stoppers are working together to crack down on thieves stealing your car's catalytic converter. The program is called Edge to Protect, and it's a first for our state. Our Sharon Phillips breaks down how it works and why this type of theft is no longer considered larceny, but something much more serious. Police say catalytic converters are attractive to thieves because they are easy to steal, and they can get hundreds of dollars for the precious metal inside them. This problem started about two years ago um, when Riverside Street Crimes Unit was tasked with investigating the catalytic converter theft, and we saw a big uh, uptick in the crime. Even local dealerships like Bill Knight Ford are dealing with the problem. So we've probably had 10 or 11 vehicles that have been affected over the last year. Trucks can be an easy target. Because trucks and SUVs are higher off the ground, Tulsa police tell us sometimes it's easier for thieves to steal the catalytic converter because they don't have to jack up the vehicle. The Edge to Protect program allows car owners to get their catalytic converters etched with their VIN number. You can stop by Bill Knight Ford, Don Thornton Volkswagen, or Jackie Cooper Infinity on Saturdays from noon to 4. We're going to ask that vehicle owners just go to our website, TulsaCrimestoppers.org, um, go to the Edge to Protect link, um, and on that link, they will be able to fill out the survey to make an appointment. Starting in November, there will be stricter penalties for catalytic converter thefts. No longer is a catalytic converter theft a larceny from a vehicle. It will now be a burglary from a vehicle that carries enhanced penalties with it. Sharon Phillips, 2 News, Oklahoma. Police tell us any vehicle manufactured after 1974 can be a target.